Hello again everyone and welcome back to Time Traveler's Coin Exchange. I've got a fun 1960D Lincoln Memorial here for you guys. Uh, this one is a business strike coin from the Denver Mint, uh, but this one is pretty special. Uh, it has been graded by PCGS and it is a D over D, uh, so um, and it's been graded mint state 64 red and it's also a small over large state. Um, so I've looked for these before coin roll hunting. I haven't found one yet. Oops, I still have the light on. We'll turn it back on in a second here. Um, but we'll take a look at the front and back of the coin. Uh, the holder here obviously has quite a bit of scratching on it. Unfortunately, there is a little scratch right above uh, the date here as well, which does make zooming in a little bit harder. Uh, this coin also is positioned in the slab in such a way um, that I can zoom in on the front all the way, um, but PCGS slabs, I can usually only focus in all the way on one side of the coin depending on how it's positioned in the slab, which side it's closer to. Uh, so I can go in uh, close enough so that I can show you guys uh, how fun this coin is, but we won't be able to get super, super close. Um, and the scratch is just kind of right over half the fun too. Um, but this coin's going to go up for sale on eBay. You can find it by following the link in the description below the video. It'll take you to this exact coin. Once there, you can also take a look at over 3,400 other PCGS graded US coins on my eBay store. Uh, we currently have one in 36 of every PCGS graded coins, uh, US coins on eBay at this moment. So there's a one in 36 chance you'll find the coin you're looking for here at Time Traveler's Coin Exchange. Uh, so let's zoom in here so that if you guys have ever wondered about one of these, uh, you can see exactly what is going on. Um, and so um, basically uh, it is a small date die and a large date die. So you have the small date and the large date. Uh, this one is the small date, I believe, over the large date, even though it kind of looks the opposite, but it's the small slash large date. Um, and so you can see coming out of the six, uh, that's where the uh, end of the six uh, would end, I believe. Um, and so that's one of the main ways that you can see. Uh, but this is also an RPM. And like I said, the scratch is kind of over half the fun part. Um, but there is a faint D that goes, uh, it's to the north of the D directly above, and it goes all the way up to the bottom of the nine. Uh, you can see kind of the curve of it. Uh, the light is hitting it pretty well right now, uh, but where you can kind of see, imagine, or see a D right there, that is actually like a trace of another D. Um, so this one is an RPM or a over mint mark OMM. Um, so it's a D over D. Um, so it's pretty cool. Um, and we can take a look here at the rest. I did notice that the B looks a little bit interesting on this one. Uh, I'm not sure if that has anything to do with being the small over large state, uh, but this is the first one I have gone to look at in person. The O also looks a little bit doubled in a way. Uh, it could just be a little bit of mint damage. And then the S also kind of looks, and so I don't know if there is some machine damage going on with this coin as well. Um, almost looks like he has like a double, like kind of like a cleft lip. Above, up above his lips there and uh, same on the throat it looks like so I don't know if this is machine damage this is the first one I've ever gotten to look at uh, but you can see a nice doubling in the zero and the six and the nine and the one um, I think when I zoomed in on the one it's kind of fuzzy when I zoom in so it's not really worth it um, but I feel like I could see a little bit more separation so a really really fun coin I've been trying to get one of these for a while but all the ones that I saw come up for auction were all well out of my price range and so I wasn't able to win them at auction uh, finally. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, now if you guys have a fun looking coin that you think is uh, not only a D over a D but possibly a small over a large state, uh, you can uh, compare here if you don't have another resource uh, to check out. Um, I've got some other fun coins uh, coming up here. And if you guys haven't checked out my other videos, I do have over 5,400 PCGS coin videos here on YouTube. Uh, feel free to hit the like, share, and subscribe if you enjoy them, and turn on notifications as I do make new videos daily. 
Uh, I also do a live stream on Wednesday and Saturday nights at 9 p.m. Pacific time uh, called The Coin Vault Has Opened. And uh, it is a Wednesday tonight, so I'll be streaming tonight. Uh, we're going to be uh, looking through some mint sellers, looking for varieties. Um, so thanks everyone for watching. Hope to see you guys uh, in the near future. And uh, have a sweet night.